no, 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 back in, back in, back in. I was going to get up. No, I have to. Come on, Danielle, you can do this. What is on my ceiling? Is that a starfish? I need to get my glasses on. Why is there a starfish on my ceiling? Wait, I have stars on my ceiling. How did I forget that? Why did my first conclusion go to starfish? When have I ever possessed a starfish? Why would it be on the ceiling? That's what my brain went to? There's nuts roasting on an open fire. This is like my 15th layer of pants. Frigid, frigid freeze balls in here. Good morning, Bertha. She is lit and ready to go. Unlike me, I'm three minutes late for my class. This class starts late, too. How do I still manage to get late to it? There's like five sad things about the fact that I literally can't even get myself up for this first period. First of all, it's dance. Requires no academic skill, yet I still manage to think that it's too much of a mental toll on my brain. Today, we're just watching videos. Again, requires zero mental skill. Third, literally starts 45 minutes later than than every other kid in school and I still managed to be late. I'm stalling. I'm stalling. I'm, I need to get to class. Shooby dooby. I swear my mom's trying to kill me though, okay? Temperature in the house below freezing levels at this point. I slept in socks last night. Socks! These things are thermal. Thermal socks. That is a heinous crime against humanity, against myself. I honestly don't even want to be myself anymore. I don't know how I can come back from this because this is low. Low. Socks? Oh my god, they haven't even started the meet yet. Shoot, am I early? Oh wait, no. I was just so late that it didn't even register. We're sharing our solos. We're only sharing a couple of them. We like picked people to present today. I got picked. Since it's so cold and my mom's trying to kill me, I'm gonna try to kill her. We're gonna make a candle. We're not making a candle. We're just gonna light it. I don't have the mental capacity to make a candle. What am I talking about? Should I cut the wick? Do it. This thing's from Walmart. It smells so good. Farm apple pumpkin. That doesn't give any. I guess it gives apple, but like the rest of it. Like, what the heck does a farm smell like? Not this candle, I'll tell you that. I'm smelling the aromas. I touched Bertha for literally two seconds. Bertha's my Christmas tree if you've missed the past two vlogs. If you've missed those, you've missed a lot. There was a cheating scandal. There was a really hot elf. Like, there was a lot going on, so you need to go watch those. But anyway, Bertha's shedding. Maybe I need to get her like a wig or something for Christmas. He has a guitar. I didn't have a guitar. This is so fun. It's like a hoedown. I joined in, that was fun. This is so good. I know you guys can't see it because I feel a little bit weird about filming someone, but this is good. That was insane. When he whipped out the guitar, I literally about had a heart attack. Good morning, Clover. Did you bring a guitar? If not, you're not welcome. All right, I'll let it slide today, but tomorrow you're bringing a guitar and a cowboy hat. Did I mention he had a cowboy hat on? A cowboy hat. A cowboy hat. It is 8 a.m. and I've already seen a man dancing around his house with a cowboy hat and a guitar. Your morning cannot compare. I swear, there's no way. There's been no more cowboy hats, which is a tad bit disappointing, but that's okay. These are all really good. There's just no cowboy hats. I just think that we should all wear cowboy hats in our daily lives. Just everyone ditch the no hat thing. No, cowboy hats all the way. It just adds that extra bit of spice into something, you know? If you're not feeling spicy that day, sprinkle on a cowboy hat. I'm sure it will brighten up something. Maybe you'll get some weird looks, but honestly, they're not gonna be weird looks. They're gonna be envious looks. We might not even watch mine. Okay, we're not watching mine today. That's a little disappointing. Okay, well, vlog ruined. No, I'm just kidding. I don't care. Can someone explain to me why my teachers decided to make today the boring day? Like, girl, it's Christmas in like a week. Give me something. Substance. Let's learn about jolly old Saint Nick. Can we not learn about like the history of Santa Claus or something? Or like the various cheating scandals of Mr. Claus and Mrs. Claus and how that affects their relationship? Heck, we could do a psychological deep dive into the mind of Tinky the Hunky Elf. I honestly don't care. You want to know what we just learned about in history class? I honestly I honestly can't even tell you. What did we learn about? Labor union? They act like I'm actually going to be able to get a job when I'm older. I film myself for a living currently. I talk to myself. This is my form of entertainment. My only friend is my camera. And they expect me to get a job with a labor union? The unions won't 
don't like me. I don't even know what a labor union is. I'm gonna be completely honest, I didn't pay attention. I have this weird fancy egg cooker thing that's supposed to make it like a poached egg. I don't know, I thought it was something different. My mom has barred me from using the stove because I literally made the house smell like burning eggs. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna try this thingy out. I used to make sandwiches in this thing, but we don't have any bread. Also, we don't have cheese. We're literally just cooking the egg. It's preheating. Ah! I haven't used this thing in literally four years. I think that we're gonna have to wait for this little light to turn green. And once it turns green, we've cracked the egg in it. We can only do one at once. And then for five minutes, it's gonna cook. And then we're done. It's an experiment. I'm a scientist now. Can you preheat faster? I'm hungry. It's still not preheated. It's been like two minutes. Come on, hurry up. It's still not preheated? I was over there for like five minutes. It does not smell good. I haven't used this thing in literally four years. So I don't know if it's gonna burn the house down. I didn't think about that. Oh well, not like I haven't done it before. I could play a whole round of Jeopardy waiting for this thing. Rest in peace, Alex. Isn't that the guy who did Jeopardy? Was his name Alex? Either way, he was a great man. He had a really nice TV voice. I really respected it. I think he's dead though. His final episode is airing on Christmas. I should watch it. Can you hurry up? I literally just figured out the death of Alex Trebek and you're still taking your time. He had Jeopardy rounds quicker than you. I feel like Gordon Ramsay yelling at children. There's this video of Gordon Ramsay. He's like, oh, I know he's cussing in it. I can't put that in, but he's like, think of some words in your head. Imagine Gordon Ramsay screaming them at children. That's the clip I would have entered in that video. It's preheated. All right, it, ow, it's hot. It's green. We're putting it in at 420. Fun. I don't know if this is the right space for this. There's no going back now. Do I jiggle it? No, I'm not gonna jiggle. I'm not gonna risk the jiggle. It's 421, so we have to wait five minutes. Do, 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 do. Do you think they're gonna play that at Alex Trebek's funeral? I really should not be joking about this, but like in all seriousness, they're gonna like bring him down the aisle in his coffin and like do, do, do. Or like as they're lowering him in, do, do. That's really disrespectful, I'm so sorry. But like, do, do. I'm just, I'm just saying, it would be a good idea. I'm waiting for the clock to change, but I think it's almost been five minutes, so I'm a little scared. I haven't opened it yet. I exercised a lot of patience because I really wanted to just take a peek. But I was really scared that it was gonna blow up too, and I didn't want to not get that on the vlog. Oh my god, it's it's 4:25. Pop it open. Oh my god. Oh my god. Does it look cooked? It looks cooked to me. I don't I don't know how to get this off. How do I get this off the thing? Give me my egg. Ah, let me get a spatula. Ah, oh dear. Fork it is. Fork it is. Oh my god! It looks good. It's exploding. It's exploding. That looks good. There it is. Looks like an egg. Oh my god. That's so good. It's like poached. Ooh, I like that. Give me some more of that. 10 out of 10. It's a little bit later. We have a couple things to do. And by a couple things, I mean we have a lot of things. We're very stressed. Christmas stress, it's starting now. Ah, anxiety. I have not opened my advent calendar in a couple days because I wanted to make sure that I got it on camera. I love you guys that much. That takes a lot of patience for me. I didn't open my egg today. I didn't open my advent calendar. I'm becoming a new person. This vlog is improving my mental health every single day. I'm improving as a person. We're gonna start off with the advent calendar that also needs to improve as a person, which is our sock advent calendar. If you've been keeping up with the Sarkashian, the sock Kardashian, the the Kardashians, the the cardigan, backyard again. There's no way to make that joke work, but you guys get where I was going. If you've been keeping up with the sock Kardashians, you will know that this advent calendar has had its fair share of struggles, but it has had its fair share of triumphs as well. So maybe today will be a triumph day. Maybe it won't, but we have two opportunities. I think. Let's open it up. Pop this baby right open. That was the quickest I've ever done that. Did you guys see that? There wasn't even a struggle moment. <gasps> Oh my god, these are go- Oh, there's a stain. That is disturbing. Ew, what is it? It's brown. That's gross. Okay, let's open up these first then. Oh my god, guys! First pair of socks. Gingerbread- Wait, no. There's like 17 Christmas things on here, and I say the one that actually isn't on it. It has like little holly leaves, a reindeer, and a Christmas tree! That's what I'm talking about! That's festive! Let's check out the one with the stain on it. Okay, those are so festive and cute. It has some hot chocolate on it. We're gonna call it hot chocolate. It's hot chocolate. It's not anything else. I don't I don't know any other brown stain that would be on a sock. Actually, I really don't. What other brown stain would be on a sock? Why is there a brown stain on my sock? Either way, we'll let it slide because these are cute and these are cute. That's a double whammy of good socks. Two good socks. It's finally coming together. It's improving. Me and my sock advent calendar. We are doing so well for ourselves. 
Ah! Oh, I accidentally opened. We're gonna pretend like we did not see that. We have 11 and 10 to open today. I actually found out that I'm opening this one backwards, but there's no going back now. I mean, it's only day two, so technically I could go back, but I don't want to. What's this first one? I have some hooks and I have a piece of rope. What? Can you separate the two rings? Aren't they already separated? Oh my god, no, they, they have to come like all the way out. Shoot. Separate them. I'm assuming this isn't just tying a knot. Ah. Oh dear. This isn't gonna go well. This is a lot of brain teasing for my brain. Maybe if I... Nope, that tightens it. Okay. What if I pull it over? <gasps> I did it! I didn't mean to do it. I really did it, but I did it and that's all that matters. Look, look, look. They're separated. I did that. I did that. I don't know how I did that. You could not ask me, but I did it and you know what? Mission completion. Let's do the next one. Alright, day 10. Day 10. Ooh, it comes with a little card. Christmas riddles! Even if your Christmas stocking is empty, you still might find me there. What am I? Um, I don't know. Dust? Answer, a hole. That's a whole lot of bullcrap. Darn it, now I feel dumb. Okay, next one. What is at the end of Christmas? Hanukkah? New Year's? S? Are they talking about the letter or, like, the words? The letter S! <gasps> I got it right! I'm where Christmas Day follows Boxing Day, and December is before November. What am I? What the heck is Boxing Day? A dictionary. Darn it. Whoa, hold on. Blech. Two mothers and two daughters each ate a portion of thanks er, of Christmas dinner. Only three portions were eaten in total. Two mothers and two daughters. So, like, one of them's the grandmother, one of them's the mom. Oh, I know that one. One of them's the grandma. Yeah, okay, I got it. During Christmas, I travel all across the world, but I stay in one corner. What am I? A letter? I don't know, because that doesn't stay in a corner. A postage stamp! Oh! Uh, I was close. I said a letter. I was getting there. I mean, not really, but we'll pretend like I did. Okay, last Christmas riddle. I really like these. When you go to cut down a Christmas tree, how far can you walk into the forest? Uh, I guess it's personal preference. I don't know. Well, you're not at a forest. You're at a Christmas tree farm. Halfway. Then you'll be walking out of the forest. Oh! So you're not at a Christmas tree farm. You know what? Those were really good riddles. I'm proud of myself. I think I got one of them out of like 10. But you know what? I did the other thing. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. So I call that a win. That was good. I enjoyed this. That was fun. I want to open up the rest of them. Patience, Danielle. You're improving. I swear, I take like two steps forward, three steps back. Guys, I'm about to go to dance and I am wearing like 17 layers of clothes. I have like 15 shirts on, four layers layers of pants. I am not messing around. I am not turning into a popsicle today. Fingers crossed I don't end up in a frozen food section. Let's go to dance. We're actually performing today, which is fun. You guys get to watch a little Christmas performance. Oh my god, it's cold. You guys, we're at dance. It is so cold. I know I keep saying that as if it's gonna change the temperature, but it's cold. <laughs> feel disconnected from my body, which is not good. I'm so cold, literally can't feel my feet. They're gonna have to get amputated. Hey guys. Hi. guys, everyone really liked your question of the day. What? What? Really? Literally, what? I got like six comments what? and they're like, I'm the girl that asked the question. <laughs> <laughs> the question. The question. It was, what was your favorite Christmas movie? YouTube sent me this message and they were like, there's so much engagement on this post. Oh and gosh. I was like, it's because of Ellie. Yeah. Ellie and her question ask of the another, day. Ask another one. Work your magic. I feel bad I'm putting her on the spot. Uh, what is your guys's? <laughs> oh, hi. <laughs> she's... Oh, she's... It's the vlog. Hey. <laughs> um, what's your favorite uh, Christmas? Cookie. Christmas cookie. Christmas cookie. Christmas cookie. Tell us your favorite Christmas cookie <laughs> in the comments. Activity. She's doing both. I have this like aunt or cousin or so someone in my family. She makes me cookies. Aunt, she's my aunt. She makes these delicious cookies. Those are my favorite Christmas cookies. All right. Okay, See you guys right. later. Bye. Thanks for the question. All right. We're back home from dance, but we've arrived at an issue. Everyone and their mother will not stop talking about my hair. If you haven't noticed, it's a little bit curly. That is because I never washed it after I put like a pound of hairspray in it on Friday night. It's Tuesday. Think about how gross that is. My hair has not been washed since Friday night. So while everyone was touching my hair today and being like, oh my 
my god, Danielle, your hair looks so good. I'm thinking, oh honey, you don't know where it's been. So we gotta fix this. We're gonna go take a midnight shower. Everyone else in the house is in a deep slumber at the moment, so we have to be a little bit sneaky, a little bit fox-like. Okay, we can't make a sound. No karaoke, which is honestly probably a blessing. I'm sure you guys are tired of hearing me sing terrible Christmas songs, but I'm not. The halls with bells of holly, fa la 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 Don't worry, I got you. I gave you a little snippet right there. But anyway, we're gonna go take a midnight shower. Come join me. We're not gonna film it this time, though. Again, we have to be sneaky. We don't have time for this. We can't have any hooligans in the shower with me tonight, okay? You little hooligans, stop. I get to smell like winter candy apple. I forgot about that. <gasps> I'm so excited. I'm gonna do a transition. Are you ready? Two, one. All right, I'm clean, thank God. Remember what I said about being quiet? <laughs> Obviously, I didn't think this one through, but you know what? This sneaky little fox, I still won't get caught. This thing is silent as a mouse. I can't even hear it. Guys, I am so clean. Do you guys see my hair? It's straight. That's proof. Today has been so much fun. I don't know. I just had a really good day today, but as Bertha would say, I am tired. I don't know why Bertha would be the only thing to say that. It seems like a pretty universal thing to say, but you know what? It's all in Bertha's personality. It's just a Bertha phrase. She's coined it. It's hers now. You can't argue with Bertha. So anyway, I'm gonna go to bed. I love you all. Good night. Deuces.